I grew two trays of microgreens, uh, radish microgreens, daikon radish, and um, started them with exactly the same tray weight and added the same amount of water to them uh, each time. And uh, radish tray one and tray two are compared, and the difference is one tray one received 18 hours of light, where tray two received 24 hours of light. And the purpose was to see which is better, 24 hours of light or 18 hours of light. And um, uh, I can um, zoom in and uh, show you the result and save you a lot of time. Uh, this harvest weight right here the 18-hour tray had a harvest weight of 175 grams, and the 24-hour tray had a harvest weight of 163 grams. That's a 7% increase for the 18-hour daylight uh, tray. So um, based on, on this real quick and dirty research, I'm recommending 18 hours a day over 24 hours. I also weighed the trays every 12 hours. And um, here is uh, from planting until harvest. Uh, at planting, this green line here indicates the dry tray weight, which was 954, just under 1,000 grams. And uh, when I watered the, and, and that included seed, when I watered the tray, it went up to nearly 2,000 grams. And then it was covered and stacked and uh, was left to germinate for three and a half days. And on Tuesday morning, I uh, picked it up uh, opened it up and put it under the light. Um, I, I added a 500 milliliters of water, actually 500 grams of water. I weighed it out and added that amount. And then uh, every 12 hours took a measurement. And as you see, the water or the weight of the tray reduced until Thursday morning when I added 700 grams of water. And uh, then the tray weight went up again, and then it dropped down uh, over time until Friday evening when I harvested the microgreens. And this actually is an example that uh, it was watered too heavily. I would have watered it less um, uh, now that I know how it turned out. So each time I took uh, weight of the tray, the following uh, time I, I compared the two weights, and this shows the decrease. On this chart, the lower, the, the, the zero line is up here, and this is a little over 100 grams decrease in weight. In other words, evaporation leaving the tray. And uh, the red, which I have to move back here, the red is 24-hour tray. The blue is the 18-hour tray. So the blue is the good one. Interesting thing is, um, so the further down you go, the more uh, water you're losing every 12-hour period. Um, from Wednesday night to Thursday morning, um, the increase it increased quite a bit, it actually decreased quite a bit. In other words, more water left the tray and uh, even more on the 18 hour. Uh, from two, Thursday night to Friday morning, there was a huge uh, uh, decrease. In other words, a large amount of water leaving the tray. And, um, and so what that means is what my interpretation is at night uh, more water is lost and especially when the light is off because for five hours six hours here the lights were off also here the lights were off but here 
the lights were on. So who knows? What could have uh, influenced this experiment? The trays were on two different shelves. Uh, perhaps they had different airflow. There is a heater vent nearby. It was not focused directly on the uh, trays, but it may have influenced it. Um, but honestly, I think that uh, the experiment is a good one, and it shows that uh, the 18-hour the, um, is, the, is the best daylight time. So here's a little bit more detail. In this one, uh, the, this is the weight of the tray, the water in the tray. And what I did was I um, took the total tray weight minus the dry tray weight. And then I also estimated based on an amount <coughs> of um, twice the harvest as to how much uh, vegetative matter was in. And I started with zero vegetative matter and I increased it uh, every time period to get a total of two times the harvest amount. So basically I'm slowly increasing the amount of uh, vegetative matter and subtracting that from the tray weight and then also subtracting the dry tray weight. And this is my best guess as to how much water is in the tray. And uh, you can see um, there are two columns here. On Tuesday morning, I, I weighed it and got the weight. And then I said, well, I need 500 grams of water. So I added 500 grams. This is actually the same time, but it represents a watering event. And then you see every, um, every 12 hour period, the, the water amount dropped. And here I watered it again and um, there's the drop. Now, if I had turned my fans on, this uh, drop would have been much steeper, and maybe I'll uh, do an experiment to show that. But uh, just thought this might be interesting. This, um, this tray had too much water. I should not have put this much water in. I should have let it continue and maybe put a a couple hundred milliliters. I put 700 mil, uh, milliliters or grams here at this point. But uh, just thought this might be interesting. Um, 18 hours is better than 24. And uh, thank you for watching.